has become a high-flying adventure for Cody the Buffalo, who stars in the movie Radio Flyer and the 1990 smash hit Dances with Wolves. This southeastern Minnesota resident is already rubbing elbows with the bigwigs. Steven Spielberg would come over and, and visit Cody and Penny Marshall. This is Lifestyles of the Wealthy and Wooly. This is where Cody the Buffalo spends his days, away from the hubbub of Hollywood. Money Creek, Minnesota is an appropriate place for a buffalo that earns more in a day than most people do. For the last uh, two movies he did, he got uh, $1,000 a day, whether he worked or not, just for being on the set, plus per diem. Cody was only a couple of weeks old when owners Mike Ogle knew he wasn't like the other buffalo that roamed their ranch about 25 miles west of La Crosse. He liked coming in the house, and uh, he thought he was a dog. He, he'd leave whenever the buffalo would come around. Here, you want to chase him? Differences made Cody destined for stardom, and the chance came when Dances with Wolves needed a tame bison. Well, Cody's the buffalo that uh, first he hits the, the horse up, uh, smiles a lot, and smiles a lot, falls off his horse, and uh, Cody attacks him. He's got the arrow sticking in him. The buffalo that Kevin Costner shoots in the movie is Cody. Cody was also speared in the movie. But in both cases, his untimely demise was carefully staged. And as befits his star status, the falls were done by... And hit it, Norman. Go, baby. Stunt Buffalo. Oh. Good, good. Careful. Here we go. Cody's lauded performance soon landed him a larger role in the movie Radio Flyer, as well as commercial work. In today's financial climate, you need the strength and stability of the buffalo. I'm more impressed probably than most people because I understand the nature of the animal and how it just goes against their nature. I mean, he'd lay right downtown Los Angeles on the street yeah. and cars going whizzing by, you know, three feet away. Cody has made it to the big time, earning nearly $100,000 for Radio Flyer, but it's not currency this bison is after. It's cookies, specifically Oreo cookies. When Cody runs on camera, it's Oreos he's heading for. You don't ever run out of cookies. You gotta have a cookies when you're filming. It's not just cookies Cody craves. This 1,700-pound star downs 300 pounds of feet a week. The star treatment extends beyond the dinner hour. The special treatment began even before Cody became famous. To Reich, he's part of the family. Cody's fame has spread overseas. Disney made a six-figure offer to buy him for the Euro Disney theme park in France. This five-year-old buffalo has many movie-making years ahead. For now, he's enjoying life in money. Money Creek, that is, a place he'll always call home. That's a good boy. Good boy. This has been Lifestyles of the Wealthy and Woolly, with those soda pop wishes and Oreo dreams. Yeah.